I'm worried that TTIP will undermine our efforts to fix our broken food system. We, our food system in the U.S. really is broken. We have farmers who are getting prices that are too low but paying too much for land. Consumers who are eating unhealthy foods that are grown with dubious technologies and corporations gaining more and more power over our food system all the time. There's a lot of work going on at the local level to rebuild our food system, making connections between farmers and consumers, um, finding ways to label GMOs, and all of that could be at risk with TTIP. We also, on the other hand, don't want to export that broken food system. We've been paying a lot of attention lately to U.S. proposals coming from corporations, coming from the government, uh, to lower meat standards in the United States. And just this week, two dozen groups sent a letter to Ambassador Froman insisting that he not try to get rid of EU standards on ractopamine or allow for chlorine rinses of chicken, things that we don't want in the United States either. On the other hand, we said what he should be doing is looking at what some of the member states are doing, like Denmark and Sweden, where they're trying to get rid of the use of antibiotics in meat. There are some positive things happening on the local level in both sides. That's what we need to be strengthening, and we need to make sure TTIP doesn't wash those gains away.